Many years ago, the rec department included in their activities a sewing room. And the sewing room was designed for ladies that wanted to quilt or knit or sew together as a, for, as a time of friendship, you know, just a time to get together. Because we were always somewhat involved with Veterans Day at the Park Circle facility, we were looking for something the ladies could do to give back. Most of them are older, they're very passionate. They had fathers, brothers, uncles, relatives that served in the wars. As we talked about it one day in a group, we just kind of came up with the idea about doing something for veterans, something that showed them that people appreciated their service. I think it just always gives them a chance to just kind of extend their love back to the community and back to people. That's where it started. And then we started looking for the material very gracious to the city of North Charleston. They have provided us the opportunity to purchase the material. Some of it was donated, but we tried to stay with the red, white, and blue theme, knowing that it was going to our veterans. But again, fortunate because that the sewing room is part of the recreation department and falls within their budget. Ms. Marvel McLeod has been our supervisor there during this project. And she is a very passionate woman she can teach about any of this, you know, quilt and sewing it. And I think it gave them a sense of bonding. This also gave us a focus of positive, a blessing back to them that they knew they were gonna be blessing others. And the blessing that they had just being together, working on something is just a lot of heart of giving and being and encouraging each other to stay positive. This year, as the change up came in our Veterans Day program, we um, pursued giving them to our veterans that will attend that program on Wednesday. Several of them be, will be given to the oldest of our veterans, and then the others will be drawn from the names that registered. So hopefully they'll feel lucky to get one and blessed. I think the greatest thing I'd say about them, they've been made with hands of love. These are women that love what they do. They love people. They love and respect our nation. They love our city and the fact that it's going back to veterans that will attend our city Veterans Day event, that's priceless. It's a good thing.